Hi, Paula. Uh, this was a lost opportunity at best for Marco Rubio after his strong showing in Iowa. His big moment to shine, and many would say that he choked. And it all started with David Muir's first question to Chris Christie. I do want to ask Governor Christie, Governor Christie, you said fool me once. Fool me twice, shame on me, when it comes to electing a first-term senator. After that, Governor Chris Christie came out swinging at Senator Marco Rubio hard. Sure. Um, first, let's remember something. Every morning when a United States senator wakes up, they think about what kind of speech can I give. Every morning when I wake up, I think about what kind of problem do I need to solve for the people who actually elected me. Shot after shot. That's not leadership. That's truancy. Christie pummeled Rubio for more than seven straight minutes. Oh, so, uh, wait a second. Is that one of the, the skills you get as a United States Senator, ESP also? Chris, everybody, I don't you think said it you is. weren't going to... Rubio punched back. Chris, Chris, your state got hit by a massive snowstorm two weeks ago. You didn't even want to go back. They had to shame you into going no, back. No. That's when Rubio got tangled up in his talking points. Let's dispel with this fiction that Barack Obama doesn't know what he's doing. Christie caught Rubio putting that line on instant replay. This notion that Barack Obama doesn't know what he's doing is just not there true. There it is. He knows exactly what he's doing. There it is, the memorized 25-second speech. Well, that's the, that's there it the is, reason everybody. why this camp... Even Rubio's fellow Floridian, Jeb Bush, seemed to jump in on Governor Chris Christie's side. You learn this. You learn it by doing it. it it's, not, it's not to say, look, let's be clear. Marco Rubio is a gifted, gifted politician. Rubio, clearly rocked by the blows, moved on, jumping back in with Ted Cruz after Martha asked about attacking North Korean missiles before they launch. Point. It is standard procedure of the United States to shoot down those missiles once launched if they pose a threat to civilians, land, Senator ships. Rubio, I'm talking about a preemptive strike well, on the launch pad. No, I understand, and that's, but, but I think it's important to note that it is, and, and Senator Cruz, I think, was alluding to this as well. Should I, should I go now? Uh, this is